Hi, I'm Aretha, and this is Product of Global Fusion. What Product of Global Fusion is, it's basically a capsule line that I started um, with different designers from all over the world just to what uh, my whole idea of Global Fusion is that we're all these different people from all over the world doing creative things and then we come together to create certain product that will, you know, 10% of it will go to whichever charity the designer and myself have decided on. This is a collection that I've, I've done with a designer called Onyx Noise. And basically what it is, is he's an African-American designer that's been working in the industry for over a decade plus. And what we've done is we've incorporated um, African fabrics and then also brought in some basics so that, you know, it's not so kitschy and so, you know, what people's idea of what Africa is. Because we're multi-dimensional people, we like different things. But the whole idea of I wanted to incorporate, you know, different African prints because the fashion industry within the last couple of years from major designers like Louis Vuitton to Chloe to everybody to Marc Jacobs have all been doing African prints. And it's unfortunate that Africans themselves are not the ones in Barneys and different outlets that make all the money. So this basically is um, this print right here is a, uh, and actually what most people don't know is the whole idea of African prints is most of it comes from the Dutch. It's Dutch wax prints that are made in Holland and then, but now local designers like in Ghana and everywhere, local textile designers have been making their own and we try our best to actually get it directly from them to do different collections. And actually this, everybody knows, um, everybody now is wearing these, you know, what they call turbans. But, you know, you, they're all basic, but now we've incorporated African print with them. And this was actually done by a local designer from Mali who basically did this in a day. Global Fusion is basically, we have three product lines. We have the black label, the red label, and the green label. The green label is everything that's recycled or, or handmade or you know, environmentally friendly things. The black label is more of a higher end collection, and the red label is more of a moderate price collection. What you're, but everything is basically one-off. All the designers that we work with, they do a, a, what we call a capsule line, which is probably like 10 to 15 pieces that we utilize. And as I said, 10% of everything that you buy will go toward an arts charity or a charity that specifically works with fashion or the arts in Africa. Ghanaian fashion right now, it's actually major. Like now Ghanaians are actually realizing what they have. They're realizing that we were basically creators of the haute couture as we know it. Because when I was growing up, there's my mom and everybody else I know, nobody has ever gone to the store to buy anything off the rack. Everybody basically gets their fabric and they go to the seamstress, their local seamstress, which is one on every single block if you go to Ghana. And basically now Ghanaians have realized their, their worth and their power and now they're actually creating their own lines, they're creating their own fashion week. And now it's just that in order to us to go global and to get, you know, over the hump, that we just need more of a, an industry to be created where they understand that you need to know how to make a pattern in order to, you know, be in a retail store because there's certain, you know, logistics and dynamics that in order for you to be in a retail store as opposed to just custom making something for every single individual. You have to be able to also be off the rack sometimes. And this is where I think the industry is going to go in order for us to be global instead of just local designers.